Yo, what is up, guys? It's Everything Zach back with another quick video. This is gonna be under like two minutes, guys, because I want to get you the solution fast. Just a reminder: make sure you're subbed, click that like button if you enjoy the video, and leave a comment on your thoughts. Or if you have any questions about this video, I'll be happy to help you out here. All right, so without further ado, also make sure you guys go follow my Twitch. Link will be down in the description. I would appreciate stream daily. All right, so I'm gonna be telling you how to install iOS 14 on your mobile device. Um, iPad, I do not have, this is not for the MacBook, but iPad, iPod, I, um, and iPhone. Uh, right here, I got an iPhone 11, and we're, I'm just gonna give you a little preview on it, alright? But basically, what I'm just gonna show you is how to download, the link to download is in the description. Alright, so, what you're gonna do, you're gonna go down into my description. Alright, once you're in my description, you click the Dropbox link. There's a Dropbox link right down in the description. You're going to click Continue to Website. You can do the app, but there's no point in getting the app. Just So just click Continue to Website. Um, after that, what you're going to do is click the file and hit Download. And hit Direct Download. Alright, just hit Direct Download. Now it's going to come up that your profile has been downloaded. Now all you got to do is go to your settings. Alright, when you go to your settings here... Um, just you, I'm gonna scroll the top for you guys, and then I'm gonna scroll back down to show you. It's gonna so, show that you've installed a profile, and that's completely normal, but that actually is only for iOS 14 because I already have it. Um, so you're just gonna go, just showing you what it's gonna look like. So, once you go in general, you're gonna hit software update. As you can see on mine, it says already updated, but if you all you gotta do is what I did, alright? Um, you just gotta install that profile. All you do, once it, that profile is installed, like I just showed you, all you do is go to software update and it'll be there to update for iOS 14 beta version. It's a safe download, but you should still get a backup going before you do it just in case. Um, I am sure that it is safe, but you do still want to be safe and it is a beta download. Make sure you install it and then go to updates and you can download it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, make sure to comment your thoughts. If you have any questions, I will be responding very fast and I would appreciate all your thoughts on the video. Make sure you leave a like if you liked it and smash that subscribe button. You have a great day. Thank you.